feel like it's really close. <laughs> oh my gosh, she's literally laughing at me. Okay. This is gonna be terrible. Oh wow, she's really good. <laughs> I didn't want to go first. What? You're all out. <laughs> I didn't even laugh and you're already making fun of me. Be gone. My name is Ella Guyot. My name is Lauren Bazell. I'm Lolo Anglum. From Papillion. I'm midfielder forward. <laughs> I'm from Papillion. From St. Francis, Minnesota. <laughs> I play center back. I'm a defender or midfield. I don't know yet. I sat in my mirror in practice. That's totally what happened. Uh, I'm a criminal justice major. And right now it's pre-med, but who knows? It's Nutrition, exercise, and health science. What is your sign? Leo. Aquarius. I'm a Scorpio. Yeah, I know. I'm scared. I know. <laughs> I know, it's bad. I'm not, I don't claim other Scorpios. Who is your celebrity crush? Troy Bolton. Uh, can I do YouTubers? Katie Stoneburner. <laughs> <laughs> that was hard to do. Oh, God. I feel flattered. <laughs> really What's the next question? Justin Bieber. Drew Starkey. I chose Nebraska. <laughs> I feel like I'm in a business interview. Um, I've never been in a business interview, but I chose Nebraska because of the facilities and I just kind of always knew when I was younger that I wanted to play in Nebraska. Close to home. Because they're known for their player development and um, it's a high level of soccer and I always wanted to play at a high level of soccer. Plus, the people are pretty cool too here. Just kidding. Okay. Oh <laughs> um, I want to be an impact player right away, so I thought that this would best prepare me for it. My injury. What happened? Tore my ACL. Came down here for rehab. Because uh, I want to hit the ground running, and the sooner you get to campus, the sooner you can get on the field, develop as soon as I could. Your favorite movie? Moana. Encanto. 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 I've seen oh. it three times. Seen Miracle Season. Your favorite band or type of music or artist? I like country or rap. R&B or country? Either 80s rock music or I don't know what it's called, but it's like the Lumineers, the 502s, and really weird range. Sounds good. One thing on your bucket list? Go to Bora Bora. And go to Europe. Skydiving or bungee jumping? Your most embarrassing moment? I was coming back from Mexico and I was like eight and you know, the food there did not agree with me. So I crapped my pants on the plane. I crapped so much that it like got in my flip flops that I was wearing. <laughs> and I like, my mom thought I was gonna be banned from the airport, but I still can get in, so. <laughs> yeah, it was in my flip flops. We had to throw away everything. There's so many to choose from within like the last week. When I was 11 years old, it's a little bit of a story, I'll try to sum it up. Okay. 11 years old, I was at like a soccer camp, like just it was like a week long camp that you got to dorm in like a college in Minnesota. Right. And I had gotten really bad sunburn because it was in the middle of summer, right along where my sports bra and t-shirt would lay. And so I was sleeping and I took my shirt off because it hurt to sleep and I couldn't sleep. And I slept walk outside the dorm without a key card and I got stuck outside the dorm. A shirtless 11 year old running around from 12 a.m. to three in the morning before someone could let me back in. That was the lowest, that was the lowest part of my life. <laughs> I'm gonna talk about it. That's so funny. Okay, well, one time I was at the pool and the lifeguard thought I was drowning. <laughs> so they jumped in to save me. How recent was this? So was it last year? It was like, Okay. Who would play you in a movie? I said Rebel Wilson, but it's kind of a joke, but at the same time, she's hilarious, so. <laughs> Jonah Hill? <laughs> I like don't even know names of people. Like, I don't even know who that is. Jonah Hill. <laughs> Wait. What? Is that the guy from David Dobrik's vlogs? No. Jonah? No. You know, the one, the big one? Yeah. I don't know. Jonah, Jonah Hill. Jonah. You can say I'm gonna have to Google him. them after this. He's... But I was gonna say Haley Steinfeld because all of her characters that she plays are like the tad bit, bit awkward or cringy. <laughs> and I was like, you know, that kind of covers it. And a fun fact about yourself. Oh. I'm missing two ribs. I was born without them. I like pickles, that's my favorite food. I wrote it down, it's really lame. I bet I had this big bullet journaling phase. Cardio or weights? Cardio, cause the endorphins. <laughs> weights. Cardio. Biggest strength in soccer? Probably like my ball striking. Heading the ball without getting concussions. I hit it a lot. Work ethic. Soccer idol. Julie Johnston. Carly Lloyd. Gwen. <laughs> how do you feel about that? I, I can't even express how happy I am. <laughs>
your pregame snack or meal? Bananas and or stinger waffles. Those things are like crack. Now that I'm here, it's the stinger waffles. Uh, a cliff bar. Really fueled. <laughs> How'd you get recruited? I actually played with Katie's team and they became interested in me and then I went to a camp. They offered me. Uh, I got recruited over the COVID period. So it was a lot of uh, through game film and lots of phone calls, FaceTime, not FaceTime. <laughs> That's <laughs> awkward. <laughs> Zoom, not FaceTime, Zooms. That's weird. <laughs> Finally, once they were allowed to have ID camps, came down for one. It's a great camp, it was really fun. Only through film, mm -hmm. so I'm just like talking to them. Goal for the next four years? Um, be an impact player. Obvious one would be to go to the NCAA tournament. Good. Win the NCAA tournament, that'd be sick. Have fun. <laughs> what are you most excited for while at UNL? Um, just meeting new people and experiences. Oh, this is gonna sound cheesy. Oh. Um, the idea of like the giant like, group of girls that are all really dedicated to getting better at soccer and winning and being very competitive while like all wanting to get like literally like the intensity coming from a bunch of small town clubs in Minnesota like it was insane to like come the first day and see everyone being like like on it and wanting to everyone to get on the same page really quickly meeting new people did you watch the vlog before arriving <laughs> <laughs> I did I studied the meet the freshies cuz I was nervous about the interview and I watched a couple other ones oh of course yeah I did <laughs> Go Big Red. Go Huskers. Go Big Red. Set, go. <laughs> you didn't even do it. I'm not doing it. Hey, hey. Oh, there she goes. Nice. Okay.